Hi everyone, I'm Marina Goncharenko, a realtor in Southwest Florida, and today I'm gonna give you a tour of Naples, paradise on the coast. Naples was founded in 1886. Early newspaper and promoters described the bay as surpassing the bay in Naples, Italy, and the name Naples stuck. We will start this tour from the center of the city where US 41 takes a turn and Fifth Avenue begins. The prestigious Fifth Avenue is the setting for most of the local events. Just like Fifth Ave in New York City, this is the spot for fine dining and shopping. If you continue west on Fifth Ave, the second half is residential, with it ending right at the beach. This is what most of the beach access looks like in Naples. Three blocks south of here, the beach access is called Wedding Beach, with an aisle that is Naples style. It's absolutely straight out of a fairy tale. A lot of these access points are reserved for residents, so this keeps the beach more private and quiet. Another thing very unique to Naples is a creative use of landscaping. The way they use these hedges is both beautiful and extremely practical for homeowner privacy. It is so common here and it gives the area a classy touch. Half a mile south of 5th Ave is another shopping and dining district called 3rd Street South. This was the birthplace of Naples and is often referred to as Old Naples. The primary beach access and the Naples Pier are located here. The beach has a very unique vibe. You don't see any high-rise buildings further emphasizing the paradise life. South of here, there are no traffic lights and it feels like one of the most peaceful areas one can live in, with almost five miles of some of the most beautiful beachfront mansions in the world. South of Old Naples is broken up into two areas. The first is Aqua Lane Shores, the second is Port Royal. This area is one of the most prestigious and wealthiest areas in the country. With the Gulf on one side and Naples Bay on the other, Aqua Lane Shores is deemed the friendliest neighborhood in Naples. Many homes are located on the water and have access to the Gulf of Mexico, with Gordon's Pass just two miles south. Here we have Port Royal Club, an exclusive club only available for eligible properties. Members enjoy the Port Royal Club's private beach, dining areas, pool, spa, fitness, and tennis facilities. There are thousands of homes here straight out of a magazine. This area has attracted people from all over who appreciate beautiful homes. Here are some of my favorites.
As we head north on US 41, a little over half a mile from the 5th Ave, we have the NCH Baker Downtown Naples Hospital, one of the four hospitals in Naples. All along US 41 is the commercial area. One mile north of the hospital is the Coastland Center Mall and shopping area. Here we start to see condo buildings on the water. A new Four Seasons Resort is under construction now. There are a number of other condominiums following until we get to the Doctor's Pass. In this area we have Louder Milk Beach and Park, another beautiful area to relax and enjoy. This creates another beautiful neighborhood called Moorings, with several bays which give many other homeowners waterfront homes with access to the Gulf. Morning joggers and bikers make the community feel very alive. The neighborhood north of that is Park Shore. Venetian Bay separates the residential home from the taller condo buildings all along the shore. As we continue north, we have Pelican Bay. It has a lot more green, both from the preserve and the golf course. At the north end, we have Ritz-Carlton along the colony of buildings. The further north we go from downtown, the taller the buildings get and start to dominate the shoreline. There are still a few properties that snuck their way into a secluded paradise. Vanderbilt Beach is the last neighborhood in Naples, also with a bay with access to the Gulf through the Cocohatchee River. Further north, you run into Barefoot Beach in Bonita Springs. It is about four miles between US 41 and I-75. From North Naples all the way south past the airport, this area is made up of all types of gated communities. There are 92 golf courses in Naples and most of them can be found here. US 41 Tamiami Trail goes all the way to Miami and for the next 10 miles past East Naples, there are new communities being developed. If you would like more information on Naples or need help buying or selling your next home, my contact information will be down in the description below. Thank you for watching and I hope this gave you a really good idea of what Naples has to offer.